What's cooking folks, Vermillion Phoenix here, and today I'm bringing to your attention Green Hill Paradise X2. This is a proof of concept developed by a team of independent developers who wanted to show that Sonic the Hedgehog could be developed as a open world exploration based game. I largely do think they have succeeded, although there's a few things to critique with the way that the game works, and that's just mainly the fact that gravity seems to be a bit too powerful in the game right now, and Sonic really doesn't seem to adhere to certain surfaces when he starts moving. Uh, this makes things like uh, going uphill particularly difficult, but everything else seems to be fine. Like That's really my only gripe with it. Besides a couple of bugs that the developers know exist in the game already, so that's a new point. But I like the experience that they've created. Uh, the ability to just look around and see what you're able to do and think about like how to move around different parts of the stage is something that really didn't exist in older, or I should say the most recent Sonic games. The originals really did have that like if you saw something that looked a little bit different or you thought you could do something different on that part of the stage or get access to a uh, part of the stage by you know taking a different path often you would be able to whereas in the newer sonic games it's essentially go along this scripted path and do it as fast as possible like only in the event where they'd have like loop-de-loops or like some sort of spiral path did were you actually able to create a shortcut by either jumping off early or circumventing that path altogether, which kind of is similar, but it doesn't really offer you a way to interact with the stage. It's basically you avoiding the, how the stage was created to decrease the time that you spend on it. Whereas here, they've created an experience where you ultimately want to learn the different parts of the stage so you can figure out how to gain access to other ones. There will be places with like really high ledges that you won't be able to get up to without a significant amount of speed and then you'll have to find a nearby place where you're able to actually generate that momentum. So like one of the taglines about the game was basically if you want it to go fast you'll have to earn it. And this does cause a bit of stress when you're trying to go uphill, uh, not necessarily for like a uh, really enormous hills that you obviously need a significant amount of speed even sometimes to go into the mock state that they've created where you absorb rings and enemies basically ignore you I believe you may be invincible during it but i haven't tested that out personally but uh like short hills that uh require a lot of jumping or hops are a little annoying to deal with and you know that's fine uh, but at the same time i think with the scale of the stage as it is right now and again, this isn't a full game, this is just a proof of concept, so I'm not really... I don't want to feel like I'm griping about the size of the stage, because it still amazes me that somebody was able to put all of this together. And I, again, I like what they've done. But just the scale of it right now, if this were a full game, would seem a bit too large. Like, you spend a good amount of time going through it. But, you know, if this was supposed to be presented to someone as a full project just to show what was possible and all the little neat things that you could fit inside of a game, it would be absolutely perfect for that. I recommend that if you guys enjoy Sonic the Hedgehog games, feel free to go take a look at the developers page, see what they've put together. The teaser video actually has the download for the game in it, so I'll link that video in addition to the developers YouTube channel below. and. Uh, feel free to pop over and say hi you know thanks for the game if you guys enjoy it i definitely enjoyed the experience myself and besides the fact that it just feels fun to play it looks great so props to whoever put this together they're like i don't know all of them or any of them personally actually so good job guys other than that uh feel free to take a look at some of the other things that i've highlighted recently and i hope you guys enjoyed this Thanks for watching and have a good one.